How's it going, everybody? So Magic Opera have released a new song here. I'm excited to check it out. This one's called Under Siege, which uh, one of Steven Seagal's better movies back in the day. Um, but uh, anywho, <laughs> that, that's, good. that's going back. Uh, but uh, I'm aging myself here. But anywho, yeah, last, if I recall correctly, it was the song, uh, the previous song by Magic Opera I reacted to was the one where we were flying around on unicorns and whatnot, all united, and it was epic and glorious. So I'm excited here. I'm excited. Uh, it, it sounds like we're battle ready on our flying unicorns and all of that good stuff, and, and uh, we're under siege. So, yeah, let's, let's give this a listen, shall we? Make sure you got your armor on, you know, your, your weapon in hand, and uh, yeah, let's, let, let's go to battle, or I guess defend. Rangers, go.
very interesting choice for a single, in my opinion, because of like the 90% instrumental uh, that this song is, <laughs> which I dig it. I, you know, I dig it. And to be honest, that's where the song shines is in the instrumentals. I mean, the, the neoclassical vibe and the, the speedy nature of it, really, really great. Reminds me, you know, very Luca Tirilli ish if you will. Um, and he, I really, really enjoyed it. Uh, the, the vocal, you know, the instrumentals, exquisite, absolutely exquisite. The guitar play here is just excellent, absolutely excellent. I loved it again, like with kind of like the neoclassical style and it just gorgeous, gorgeous. The, the keyboard work here, stunning, stunning. You know, the musicianship, the, the instrumentals, all of that, fabulous, absolutely fabulous. A, a treat for the ears, if you will. I, I was just really impressed and just swept away. It's just stellar, absolutely stellar. Um, you know, the only thing that, to me, which I, I'm kind of glad that the, the vocals are, yeah, nothing wrong with the vocals. I liked the vocals themselves, but the vocal melody was just a little bit lacking in my opinion, especially in the first part, um, when there was a little bit more of the, the, the vocals, cause towards the end, it was just more of a brief, uh, spot. But uh, early on, it just felt a little meandering, you know, with the, the nature of the song and how speedy and kind of frenetic and all that that it was, it kind of felt like the, the vocal melody was kind of holding it back a little bit, you know, like holding the energy back, like pulling the reins, you know, on the song a little bit. So it was kind of like you're wanting to be swept away by this, this speedy, technical, neoclassical music, you know, guitar and, and keyboard and, and all that, the drums pounding away. But then the vocal melody was kind of, it felt like a restraint, you know, and so it, it, it was kind of nice when um, it, the instrumentals just kind of took over because then it felt like the song really was unleashed and uh, it, it just really could, could shine um, and go wild. So yeah, that's the only thing, you know, I just feel like the, the vocal melody was a little basic and, and just, you know, it didn't quite capture the, the spirit and, and the energy of the music. Um, so it, it just, you know, it, like I said, that's the best way I can describe it. It's just, it, it felt like it was kind of holding, holding the song hostage a little bit. Um, and then once the, the vocals stopped, uh, it, it just took off and was excellent. With that being said, uh, the vocal sections were by no means um, bad. Uh, you know, they get the job done, but the song is at its best when it's just the music. So maybe a little bit more of a, a dynamic or, or frenetic kind of uh, uh, vocal melody in here for this kind of song. Maybe kind of like dueling vocals, some, you know, back and forth kind of stuff. Just something not quite as... Um, uh, regimented, you know, it, it just felt very just regimented and, and kind of rhythmic to the point that wasn't quite matching the energy of the song, but uh, that's just my two cents on that, but uh, still aside from that, uh, this is definitely a glorious piece of music here, and uh, Magic Opera is showing once again that um, uh, there are good things in store. There are good things in store for January 27th. Um, I'm very much looking forward to it. You know, as a whole, I like the previous single um, better, but um, this song it does not diminish my my uh, uh, excitement for the new album. It, it just continues to, to further grow my excitement because I mean, this is some stunning work here, especially musically. Oh. Wow, what a joy. What an absolute joy. So, really great stuff. I cannot wait for this full album. I, I'm looking so, so forward to it. I think it's going to be majestic. But let me know in the comments down below, folks, what uh, you thought of this one here. Uh, has it compared for you to the uh, previous single? Let's chat about it in the comments, and I'll catch you all next time. Ranger.